Hey there, Will here. Think about this. What is the most important thing in your life? Today's Bible story is about a story Jesus told. There was a man who was very rich. The most important thing in his life was himself and his money. There was also a poor man. He had nothing, but he loved God. Watch this video. Jesus had been teaching his disciples. He told them parables or stories to help them understand things about God and his kingdom. One day, Jesus told his disciples a parable about a rich man and a poor man. Jesus said, every day a rich man dressed in nice clothes, purple and fine linen, he ate whatever he wanted. But a poor man named Lazarus sat at the rich man's gate. Lazarus's body was covered in sores and he was hungry. Lazarus wished he could eat even the crumbs and scraps of food that fell on the floor under the rich man's table. Instead, wild dogs came and licked his sores. One day, Lazarus died. The angels carried him to heaven where Abraham was. The rich man died too, and he was buried. The rich man did not go to heaven. He suffered without God in the place where there is sadness and pain. The rich man looked up, and he could see Abraham far away in heaven with Lazarus. The rich man called out, Father Abraham, have mercy on me. Send Lazarus to help me. I am suffering. Abraham replied, Son, remember your life. You had so many good things and Lazarus had nothing but trouble. Now, Lazarus is comforted here while you are suffering. Then Abraham said, There is a great divide between us like a pit and no one from here can cross over to you Neither can anyone from there cross over to us. The rich man said, Then Father Abraham, please send Lazarus to my father's house on earth. I have five brothers. He could warn them so that they will not come to this place of suffering and pain too. But Abraham said, They have the scriptures, the law of Moses and the writings of the prophets. They should read and learn from that. The rich man argued, No, Father Abraham, but if someone came to them from the dead, then they will repent they will turn away from their sin and turn to God. But Abraham said, if they don't listen to the scriptures, to Moses and the prophets, then they will not listen, even if someone comes back from the dead. Those who receive salvation from Jesus have changed hearts. They treasure Jesus above any earthly treasure. Getting into heaven has nothing to do with who you know, what you wear, or what you do. Entering into heaven requires faith in Jesus, the Son of God. Who do you think deserve to go to heaven? The rich man or the poor man? No one deserves to go to heaven. Going to heaven has nothing to do with whether you're rich or poor. Those who trust in Jesus will be with God forever. Those who reject him will suffer without God forever. What do you treasure most?